All right, we're going to make a map key. And let's open up a part just so that we have something on the screen. And looks like we have a tab here. We don't want that tab. So I'm going to have to go delete that from the session. Thought I did, but it didn't take, obviously. All right. So in our environment, we're going to go to settings here. It's going to be a new, we'll use the default of two. Call it display, and we'll call it give it a little bit of a description. Record. So we'll file options, and we will save the display. Colors, let's uh, keep it the same, except for maybe the graphics. Let's go and change the datum color just to have something different. Model display, change your settings, increase your quality. And that looks like everything there. Let's go in and make this very high and dimmed. Thick lines. Turn on your tags. And let's kick it up to four decimal places. Click OK. Uh, let's do no for save. And let's do a couple of other things. We're in the view tab here, so let's go into our standard orientation. <coughs> Named views. Got a couple on this one. You can use your top, front, side, whatever it is. And display style. Maybe even we'll go in with shading. And let's change our colors. And stop. So you can use this map key to create a variety of things. Click OK. I do want to store it. Click All. I had one called display settings, so I think I'll use the same name. And close. And let's just turn our model. And click on F2. All right, so there's your F2 <coughs> map key. If we go over to our options again and customize the ribbon, click on map keys, got one called display. And Let's put it over in the model tab instead, main tab, and create a new group. And add the display to it. Come up with some unique name. <coughs> and let's export. I got one called Display Setup. You can type in a similar name.
And let's close this. So let's erase everything that's in session. Maybe set our working directory differently. And open up the part. And we have our display button here. Let's click on it. Or you can click on your uh, press F2. So it didn't rotate the model. And let's close this and see what happens if we uh, take everything out of session again. And let's open up a different part. Make any difference what it is. Little assembly here. Let's hit F2 and you can see the map key work. Make as many map keys as you need to automate the processes that you use a lot. And it helps with the design sequence, design intent, and also the speed at which you can complete certain activities.